Hello Libra, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star Star Star, and welcome to your reading. Libra, this reading is about Saturn retrograde. Saturn is becoming retrograde in its own sign, starting from 17th of June, and it will stay in that position till 4th of November. Okay, and we'll see uh, how your life uh, will get impacted because of Saturn retrograde. How all the areas of your life, like love life, your career, your money, your health, how all these areas of your life will get impacted during the Saturn retrograde period. Okay, this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa, and time is fluid, Libra. I would appreciate if you would hit like, share, and subscribe, and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the video. I'll shuffle the cards, I'll lay them down and then we'll discuss the energies. Okay, so let's get started now. Let's get started. Okay, let's get started. So, Libra, what is the theme for Saturn retrograde? We have five of wands. What do you need to know regarding your love life? Three of pentacles and six of swords. Wonderful. What do you need to know regarding your career? We have ace of wands and then we have the page of cups. Interesting. What do you need to know regarding your health? We have emperor and death and rebirth. Interesting. What do you need to know regarding your money? Queen of Pentacles and then we have Judgment. Interesting. Okay, I'm pulling out some Oracle cards and we'll see what are the messages from higher powers and the universe, especially for this retrograde period. Okay. So the zodiac signs which are coming across as important and crucial for the retrograde period are Sagittarius, Aries, Scorpio. Aries is coming across as very strong. Okay, rest and rejuvenation, journey, then cornucopia, and then we have a thinking woman. Okay, wow, beautiful. So we'll discuss the tarot cards first and then we'll move on to the oracle cards, okay? Before I start with your reading, Libra, I want you to know a couple of things about Saturn retrograde, about planet Saturn, okay? Uh, this is irrespective of the zodiac sign. This is a general message for all. But it is important that you know it. Okay. Uh, Saturn uh, is known as taskmaster. Saturn loves when you work hard. Saturn feels pleased when you work hard. Saturn feels pleased when you are fair and just in your behavior towards yourself, towards others. Okay. Saturn does not like procrastination saturn does not like anyone acting lazy saturn expects you to work hard during the retrograde period it will keep on showing you things that are pending in your life okay it will keep on reminding you through various means as to what is pending in your life it can literally anything can be pending in your life say for example there is a lot of clutter that has got accumulated and you need to clean that up that is pending say for example uh, you since last couple of months you are thinking about uh, making a switch in your career or switching your job okay but you somehow you kept on delaying that okay Saturn will keep on reminding you no start searching start making applications for new jobs okay start searching a new job okay so Saturn will keep on reminding you and Saturn will keep on uh, pushing you in that direction okay that this is pending, you got to complete that. Uh, so whatever is remaining will come to the surface. Whatever is pending is come to the surface. Whatever uh, is, if there is any unfinished business that comes to the surface. Okay. Say for example, some repairs and renovations are pending. That will, Saturn will keep on reminding you that, that this is pending, especially during the retrograde period. Okay. Say for example, if there is unfinished business between you and one of your ex, you might even see your ex coming back in your life okay so uh, it happens like say for example the if you guys parted ways in in uh, in not uh, so amicable manner there were a lot of uh, questions that remain unanswered okay the the closure was not happened and the closure did not happen it it is possible that one of your exes or your multiple exes may try to come back 
either for closure either for reconciliation whatever it is it is up to you what is it that you want okay but if there is an unfinished business they will try to come back so saturn gives you an opportunity to reflect to review to take certain things to its end goal okay so that's what saturn is about saturn is a taskmaster it will it will put on some additional responsibilities on you but it will also ask you to complete the previous past pending responsibilities okay you might also find that you are running around a lot during the saturn retrograde period because of the additional responsibilities because of the new work that is coming your way okay but saturn also makes sure uh, that you know it, it just not doesn't make you run around it also rewards you it depends upon the karma that you are doing karma is a sanskrit word okay karma means the action that you take okay it's the word is actually karma okay and it means the action that you take if you are taking a good action uh, good rewards will come towards you if you are taking a bad action uh, bad rewards will come towards you so it depends upon whatever karma you are doing accordingly the rewards or the returns will come towards you okay so this is about retrograde uh, this is about a retrograde period and this is about uh, saturn okay so let's see what is the theme for you guys libra for the retrograde period we have five of wands okay with five of wands i feel like saturn you will you will kind of feel that's that you're being pushed into certain challenges every now and then okay like you you probably might feel that uh, you take one step and you are being uh, posed with a challenge you take second step you are being posed with another challenge you take third step you are taking another you are posed with another challenge or hurdle okay so saturn is putting some hurdles and obstacles because saturn wants you to discover uh, the true potential okay saturn thinks that you have tremendous amount of potential in you which has has remained undiscovered okay either you are not aware about it or the world needs to know what kind of a potential you have and one doesn't know the gift or the potential unless or until they face challenges okay so saturn wants you to know that during this retrograde period libra i i am going to push you to unleash your true potential i am going to push you to find to get in touch with uh, your true self to get in touch with to find your true potential okay and i will kind of pose certain challenges for you and i'll see how you overcome those challenges okay so and i feel libra you are someone who doesn't shy away from challenges you are someone who loves challenges you are someone when posed with a challenge you you are certainly not a zodiac sign who likes to run away no you are definitely not that zodiac sign okay you are someone who are like okay uh, the challenge has come and you like to show middle finger to the challenge you like to overcome it okay you you like to overcome it with equal vigor and intensity uh, okay and you like to show to the world that i am victorious i have overcome the challenge okay so saturn also likes to test you accordingly i feel like there will be certain challenges but by the end of retrograde period you will kind of realize that you have become a different version of yourself okay saturn has made you to find your true version saturn has forced you to find your true version and you will be so happy with who you have become by the end of this uh, retrograde period okay so don't shy away from challenges don't shy away from any hurdles or obstacles you face only think of it as something is coming my way because saturn is trying to test me right now okay but by the end of the end of this retrograde period something amazing is happening okay and you will be happy with who you are becoming you will be happy with who you have become you will be happy with a newer version of yourself okay a newer version will be extremely confident extremely powerful version and that is something that you don't want to let let it go okay as far as your love life is concerned three of pentacles okay you are building you are certainly building a connection with someone okay but for that i also see that you'll have to put in the hard work saturn is saying that no focus on this connection do whatever you're required to do to sustain this connection okay and then only you will see some miraculous results 
with three of pentacles three of pentacles is you're building up something you're creating something you're putting efforts you're using your talent you're using your skill you're using your expertise you're seeking help from others to build whatever you're trying to build okay so you are leaving no stone unturned to make things possible okay so the six of swords next to three of pentacles is also an indication that you have to have your priorities clear if something is uh, distracting you away from whatever you're required to do don't do that rather than getting distracted walk away from the distraction okay so saturn is saying that if you see something is uh, distracting you away from the connection that you're supposed to form with someone okay rather than focusing on the distraction you walk away from the distraction distance yourself from the distraction okay so uh, it might happen it might happen that you are trying to build a connection with someone specific but then all of a sudden uh, say for example uh, someone else becomes interested in your partner okay and you are getting jealous and frustrated and angry and you're getting into fights with your person because someone else a third party is becoming interested in your person and your person is saying that i'm not at fault i did not ask that person to come towards me and i'm not even entertaining that person i know i like you and i'm focused on you why are you focusing on that third party you should not be focusing on that third party okay so rather than focusing on the distraction walk away from the distraction focus on the relationship focus on what you need to focus on focus on your partner okay the third party won't be able to do anything or the person who is interested in in your in your guy or girl they won't be able to do anything okay so saturn is saying that focus is important in love life what matters is has to be clear okay what matters in your love life has to be clear to you as far as your career is concerned we have ace of wands okay and page of cups so saturn is saying that i will keep on sending new opportunities okay i will also keep on sending certain distractions so this theme is very common for you libra uh, throughout the throughout the uh, what shall i say throughout your retrograde period okay saturn will be will show you the goal this is the goal that you have to achieve but i will keep on setting hurdles and i'll keep on sending distractions okay i'm going to test you how much determined you are to reach towards this goal are you interested in the distractions are you interested in the goal okay so saturn is will be testing you it will you will experience push and pull energy during the saturn retrograde period on one hand you will feel like saturn is calling you towards this goal saturn wants you to fulfill this goal saturn is like encouraging you to fulfill this goal but on another hand you will also see a lot of distractions okay you will also see you're walking towards this goal but at every single step there are certain challenges there are certain distractions saturn is like testing your will power and determination over here as well in the career as well saturn will keep on sending you passionate opportunities as far as work is concerned there is also a new beginning for you new beginning assured for many of you in saturn retrograde period okay but at the same time there will be certain distractions in uh through other means as well like you know uh you are trying to focus on your work but then someone else in whom you are not interested will try to distract you constantly by sending some text messages that i love you and i'm i am interested in you let's go out on date and you have communicated to that person like no i'm not interested in you and they will keep on sending you messages and they'll keep on distracting you and pursuing you real hard and you are like dude i'm focusing on my work what the hell is going on i told you i'm not interested in you i'm interested in someone else and i'm already with someone else okay stop sending the messages i'm not interested in you but this person will keep on sending you messages and will keep on distracting you so it's like what action you are taking are you blocking this person are you telling them in a firm manner like no i don't want you you're distracting me you're not understanding okay so the opportunities work related opportunities are coming your way for sure in fact i see a lot of new beginnings as well okay i also see that you will be pursuing some creative things okay i see a mix and match of couple of things say for example if you're a person uh, with a finance background okay you will continue doing your thing in finance but at the same time you will also start pursuing something related which is very much creative 
okay you might want to become an artist you might pick up some you might uh, think about learning certain hobbies and all that stuff okay say for example you are already an artist okay you are a content creator or you are a, you are a painter or oh, you are an you play instrument you are a musician uh, you are a singer whatever it is okay and you are doing good over there but on another hand you are also thirsty to get some knowledge from another field say for example in in finance or say for example in any other field i don't know why i heard as agriculture okay uh you will try to collect information about the other field as well okay to make money to pursue your passion maybe you were always interested in this as well so i see you uh, having multiple careers or you starting multiple careers in the retrograde period like i told you saturn is pushing you to know your true potential okay so i see you doing multiple things right as far as your uh, health is concerned we have emperor and death and rebirth wow so death and rebirth is is denoting some drastic changes okay for especially for many of you who are working around your health if you are trying to lose weight if you are trying to gain weight if you are trying to adopt some healthy habits eating habits uh, healthy lifestyle okay and if you are facing certain uh, difficulties so far or the the desired outcome was not happening despite you putting in the efforts in the retrograde period you will see that things are coming under control in fact you will see major changes happening okay say for example if you are trying to reduce weight and if you were reducing weight only by half kg or 1 kg so far you will see a drastic fall of 5 to 6 kg or 10 kg so far in a month's time okay usually if you work out if you put in the efforts and if you are able to reduce 1 kg or 2 kg in a month in uh, in a month uh, especially during the retrograde period you will see that there is a fall of 10 kg okay so that's what i see there are some drastic changes that are happening there is in fact i see there is an improvement things are coming under control if you are fighting uh, certain illnesses or diseases they are coming under control okay so things are coming under control whatever you are doing it's working as far as your health is concerned continue the medication continue healthy lifestyle continue with your dietary habits continue with your exercise whatever you are doing it is working in your favor in the retrograde period you will see some drastic changes positive changes happening in your health okay as far as money is concerned we have queen of pentacles and the judgment judgment is kind of telling me that there is some sort of freedom that is coming your way financial freedom maybe uh, you know you probably you were uh, you have you have taken a loan okay and you are paying some hefty emis okay and it was becoming difficult for you to pay the emi i believe that especially during the retrograde period you will start some alternative source of uh, sources of income which will help you in uh, in in paying the emi is pretty smoothly so the difficulty that you are experiencing in paying the emi is that will go away for some of you i see you doing the entire repayment of your loans okay the financial burden will go away there is some sort of freedom that is coming your way so it's also likely that this freedom will come through various ways say for example you might win a lottery you might win some kind of a jackpot you might uh, notice that there is a there is a drastic rise in your monthly income or in your daily income okay so something is changing and it's making you happy it is it is giving you some sort of a relief queen of pentacles is also letting me know that your monetary situation is improving uh, to a large extent the way you are managing your budget is fantastic okay the way you are managing your finances is finan uh, is is fantastic you have diversified you have diversified your uh financial risk you have uh, you have diversified your financial investments and whatever you're doing is actually paying off is actually giving you some amazing returns okay so financial situation is good for many of you i also see that promotions are happening you're sitting on a higher position with the queen of pentacles if you're doing something of your own some recognition is coming your way through the clients clients are very much impressed with the services or the products that you're providing okay a uh, good uh, some favorable testimonies are coming your way so i see that you will be able to establish yourself monetarily the fear of struggle related to money 
that is going going away the fear is going away and the fear is going away because the struggle is going away struggle around money is going away for you you will see and it will not just remain confined to retrograde period like the struggle during the monetary period is going away but once the retrograde is finished by 4th of november then again the struggle will start no that's not happening okay now let's see what are the messages from higher powers and the universe we have rest and rejuvenation uh in the midst of everything don't forget to pamper your soul don't forget to take care of your body don't forget to take care of your mind your soul needs some rest your body needs some rest you are working around you are working hard a lot you are running around a lot so make sure that you are taking care of what you need to take care of okay you are starting some spiritual journey embrace that journey okay and keep an keep a curious mind as to what you are going to discover during this journey okay don't don't be reluctant towards changes don't be reluctant towards this journey this journey during this journey you're meant to learn a lot you're meant to experience a lot okay so just be open to experiences just be open to learnings whatever is whatever is coming your way embrace it this is a fantastic journey that you're starting in your life for many of you i also see some relocation is on the cards we have six of swords as well so relocation is something uh, is on the cards for you i feel like this is going to be an international relocation cornucopia some massive abundance is coming your way you probably are doing something of your own okay i also see you becoming an entrepreneur so massive abundance is coming your way thinking woman some of you if you if some of you are planning to go back to school college university please go ahead and do that because that is something that will you will be proud of okay there is some additional degree that you are trying to pursue or there is something else you are trying to do you will be extremely proud of whatever you are doing okay so thinking woman all right i hope this resonates libra hit like share and subscribe comment down below uh all right take care and bye bye